to yes sir yes sir, yes, sir. so mm. yes sir so, people started migrating from sql to hadoop right hmm so the sir, old sdf is on hadoop to same hai na same hai hadoop ke andar hdf is ek part hai okay okay hadoop file directly file so people started migrating from sql to hadoop hadoop right so so all the means all the previous data they can't delete they need to migrate all the all means all the data which is present inside my sql to hadoop is now clear what is my requirement फिर से रिपीट करेंगे आवाज ब्रेक हो गया था समझ लो तुम्हारा एक डेटा है जो ऑलरेडी पहले पहले तुम्हारे कंपनी था जो माइ सिक्वल पे काम करते थे नाउ यू आर प्लानिंग टू मूव योर कंपनी टू बिग डेटा ओके सो न्यू सर्वर लिए एवरीथिंग यू हैव टेकन न्यू सो नाउ द जो जितना भी तुम्हारा अभी तक का जो काम है डेटा है वो तुम तो डिलीट नहीं कर करोगे करेक्ट मतलब सो यू नीड टू माइग्रेट ऑल द डेटा टू बिग डेटा राइट हां so how will migrate manually you can't go and migrate all the data right one by one it will both right data rahega not easy to migrate one by one with the help of vnet if we download then very hard so hadoop has given you one tool which is known as scope so what yeah so what is the use of scope it's it's a to to migrate data from mysql to hdfs okay clear yes no yes sir so today we learn a scope how to migrate data from mysql to hadoop hdfs are you clear koi doubt nahi koi doubt to bolo no sir no doubt right okay so just follow whatever i am doing okay vnicp just open vnicp everyone dhyan se karna fir bolna mat koi ki samajh nahi aaya it's little bit complicated just open your server like this username root password is hadoop right till now clear हाँ सर. See inside home folder what I will do inside home folder I will create one folder with name for example Chandana local. Okay. So just now I have told you to download one file right? Yes sir. Which file? Three point one lab three point one. Lab three point one. Three point one, right? Ah. Just I will transfer. Just unzip that one and transfer the file. Okay. Yeah, sir. Accept. Do. Just tell me. Who will tell me? Tell me. So we have to upload after unzipping, right? Yeah.
Till now, everyone clear? Yes, no. How the fuck yeah? Transfer the file. Hello? Who oh, yeah, sir? So, who oh, yeah? Nice, sir. Nice, sir. Just complete the book. सर डायरेक्टरी तो बना दिए हैं लेकिन जब वहां खोल रहे हैं तो बता नहीं रहा है डायरेक्टरी है नहीं ऐसे बोल रहा है गलत दे रहे हो के सर रूट में रूट में डायरेक्टरी पे, पेस्ट किए हम लोग ठीक है मैंने पेस्ट किया रूट में नया डायरेक्टरी बनाया विनय करके ठीक है उसके अंदर लैब 3.1 मैंने पेस्ट किया पेस्ट किया कि ट्रांसफर किया ड्रैग एंड ड्रॉप किया है हां तो बट जब हम लोग जब मैं रूट में सीडी विनय में जाने चाह रहा हूं मतलब विनय में जाना चाह रहा हूं तो बोल रहा है नो नो डायरेक्ट नो सच डायरेक्टरी फाइल और डायरेक्टरी ऐसे बोल सेव करो 1 मिनट डन सर डन या मैंने वेरीफाई किया इट इज पेस्टेड इन द डायरेक्टरी ओके आई आप सर कर रहे हो एक मिनट सर मेरा नॉट रिस्पोंडिंग हो गया है क्रोम मैं कुछ भी नहीं कर सकता अभी ठीक है प्लीज आप स्क्रीन देखो तो समझना ठीक है जस्ट ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड फ्रीज हो गया है कुछ नहीं देख रहा है मुझे ठीक है तुम समझना फिर बताना ठीक है हाँ सर सो टिल नाउ दी एवरीवन प्ले राइट यस नो कुछ बोलो चंद्रा क्लियर सोमे क्लियर हाँ सर आई टोल दैट टाइम उन्होंने ओके सो व्हाट इज़ द पर्पस ऑफ इसको इंपोर्ट सो सो जस्ट फॉलो द स्टेप एवरीथिंग सी फर्स्ट व्हाट विल डू सी व्हाट वी डिड सो इन पुटी आफ्टर ट्रांसफरिंग द फाइल व्हाट आई डी सीडी लेफ्ट एंड left 3.1 right so here we can see yeah so here we can see pwd so where i am left 3.1 so here we can see three file 
clear everyone so inside this we can see salary dot txt just do tl tl salary dot txt so you will see how many record you can see multiple record right and is separated by comma means there are total four column f 22 9 everyone clear uh, no need to do see currently no need to do just understand this one okay yeah. here in, means if you are doing cat or tail everything fine just to yeah. see the content so inside salary dot txt we can see multiple record see all the rec all the row is separated by comma right so here we can see total four record right f 22 9000 and this one so this is one record separated by comma this is one separated by comma this is a last and like this clear everyone yeah. you remember last yeah. time while yeah. learning sql we have done same exercise yes no uh. so now what we'll do tell dot xc now salary of txt is comma separated file Re represent gender age salary and zip code now sell copy salary of txt into temp folder c cp salary of txt to plus tmp is now clear temporary folder mein kyun copy kiye sir last bar kyun kiya tha mysql mein same thing kiya same exercise hai temporary file mein sir yeah see, see whatever you can do you can keep for now just understand nothing else just we are sending this file to temporary okay sir tem mujhe temporary is a file that you already have or now you are giving oh. that command yeah already see already temp file will folder will be present oh, just we are okay, moving okay. the salary of okay. tst uh, into this temp okay okay nothing else now i will run this below command my sql test so first i will go to my sql use tes test okay so so data bases so so table four tables here we can see one salary so what i will do i will drop this one drop table salary see now i think everything is treated so nothing so now what we'll do my sql test salary dot this command already we have seen right yes sir we have seen you have seen and you have done also yes no yes sir we have done so why we are doing this one sorry so just you have to do like this so why we so if you open this salary dot sql so there is list of some command is there so here you can see see it what is doing is creating table table right mm. so now it's loading so load data in file so from where is loading so that's here temp so that's why i given temp because i have already i sent this file to temp right so mm. that's why i have given temp path inside temp there is one file as salary dot txt into table salary fill terminated by comma okay mm. clear everyone till now ah, yes sir. no yes. now you just go to my sql and verify use txt test so sir abhi tak procedure same hi hai na how we copy it mode and yeah select start from salary clear if 50 is on 50 rows acha hame is baar naya table nahi banana pada wo apne aap kaam kar gaya na to last baar bhi humne table nahi banaya tha same procedure ayush like what we learned last time hmm. we had learned uh, two ways of uh, transferring file now ha uh ha -huh. just uh, this just come second yeah just complete this one till now uh. ha uh, sir isme koi dot aana nahi chahiye kyunki same thing you have done
sir if file is already present should we delete and do this procedure again if already present then you can leave but just for practice purpose you can do once ha ah, sir sir you executed the create table statement in uh, mysql once again right no no after deleting you? no nothing just i will drop and with the help of mysql it will do this this command only will do it will create table and all everything i will not manually no need to create anything see in the script if you open the script already everything is present see create table it will create everything okay okay you. okay yeah got it sir last yeah सब इतना जल्दी सब भूल जाते हैं आप लोग सर तीन फॉर थ्री वीक्स दिस और एवरीथिंग इज टू मच एक्चुअली ये इतना बार प्रैक्टिस कराया है मींस इसको याद हो जाना चाहिए अभी तक सर स्टेप दैट्स व्हाई आई एम गोइंग वेरी स्लो लेकिन एवरीवन इज डू हैविंग इंटर्नशिप्स some we all are preparing for exams and this is last final semester so everyone has procedures for the further Yeah, that's why yeah. I'm going very slow. Each yeah, because see, if it was done in the middle of our course, like during semesters, it was fine. Just last moment, everything. Yeah, no. Was... Yeah, no problem. Just, just make sure that you will practice you after class everything. Just try yeah. to practice. Because you know, abhi yaad hai, me after one week, after two week, me after one month, each and everything you'll forget, and this will help you in future. Yes, yeah, sir. And that time, no one will be there to help you. ये होने के बाद आप लोग बताना ठीक है डन विनय आयुष आप लोग और मेरा तो सर लैपटॉप काम करना ही बंद कर दी काम नहीं कर रहा मेरा लैपटॉप अभी डन फ्रॉम माय साइड ओके See once see now after creating each and everything, so just we'll verify 
so we can see our table right all the data so <clears throat> here to import any table so basically what happened in my scope there are two important concepts what is first one is scope import and second one is scope export import means you are copying the data which you are copying the data from mysql to hdfs and export means reverse from hdfs to mysql so whenever you are doing any import scope import so every time this particular sentence still here is common scope import hyphen hyphen connect jdbc mysql localhost test so test is so this one is nothing just some database <clears throat> hello so currently salary one where we are having inside test database right so yes or no hello yes sir yes sir. whenever we are doing scoop imports just we write scoop import hyphen hyphen connect so we are saying to our system that we need to import means we'll copy data from mysql to hdfs so before copying the data we need to establish one connection right how is linux server will know that which server to connect so that's why i'm providing the ip means details of the server which server they need to connect so that's why hyphen hyphen connect jdbc mysql and localhost because this is inside my server that's why localhost you need to go inside which database i need to go inside test database and which table you want to copy salary so that's why i have given hyphen hyphen table salary clear ha yes, sir yahan tak koi doubt kisi ko so this uh, where is this command executed i'll tell you till now clear right Ah. Okay. So where to execute? Just come out from my SQL, and just you need once again. See here. Just directly you can run this command. A scope import hyphen hyphen connect. Before that, what see before running this command, what we'll do? We'll check in HDFS whether any file is present or not. If present, we'll first delete that one. Okay. So how to go inside HDFS? HDFS D DFS hyphen ls slash. See here, we'll see salary is there. Is salary not there, right? Yes, no. It's not there. Which I'm mean, inside which directory? Root inside parent. Yeah, Slash. it's not there. So now what I'm doing? A scope import hyphen hyphen connect. Just which server we need to connect? Which database? Test database inside this which table? Salary. Salary. Okay. Where I want to load? So inside slash I have given. So here already present inside. So by default it will see by default whenever you are importing it will import in default location. So what is default location under landing page? So what is landing page for this one? Hello. Root distance. Root. Yeah. Okay, not slash. So here root slash. here slash is parent. Yeah. Landing parent. page is root. So we are sending directly to root. So first here already is their salary. First we'll delete this one. HDFS CFS hyphen RMR, which this one Please I want to give. Right. Sorry, no, you can give like this also. Now just I will verify. See one command you can write in multiple ways. See now I can't see any data, right? Yes, no. 
Now just I will yes, run this command. So it will run some internal program like MapReduce and all. So what I have told you in Hadoop, we have made two component. First one HDFS and MapReduce. So MapReduce to process any data. So here we are processing some data. So internally it's calling MapReduce. So that's the map job is running. So now just go inside this particular folder and verify. Hello? Yes, sir. Can you hear me? Yeah, so here I can see, right? Salaries. Yes or no? Now just yes, do cat. See cat on this file, salaries. So you can see the data. See, so by